Yeah, actually, when I was dressed as a taco, everyone laughed because apparently you don't say taco. Do you say taco? So taco, yeah. <laughs> So I am Dr. Alexander Pullen and I teach mathematics. So generally the large calculus class is linear algebra. Average, oh, wonderful. Pretty average and amp. Semicolon, a cool guy. What does amp mean? Does it mean something? Okay. <laughs> but I'm pretty average and cool. I like that. Like dangerously mediocre. Oh poor. Ugh. So Professor Pullen is an average professor. He doesn't put much effort into his what? He doesn't put much effort into his work though, as I corrected him numerous times in office hours. Well, I should probably put more effort in. I did find his teaching to be very helpful though. I did enjoy the fact that he gave practice midterms and posted the lectures online. He's very approachable, but his explanations are Byzantine. Well, does, does that mean they're like ridi ridiculously elaborate? Yeah, it probably means I'm excessively complicated. Yeah, I hope so. Byzantine. I'd love to have a conversation with that person. I'd make it as complicated as possible. Inspirational, caring, hilarious. Best maths teacher and professor I've had by far. Super caring about specific needs as well. Sick Scottish accent as a bonus. Well, the honest truth is, I don't have a Scottish accent. I have an English accent, but thank you anyway. I wish I had a Scottish accent. <laughs> Rather than leaving a mean review and rate my professor, it's better to leave it in actual course evaluations because I look at those really, really carefully because they are much more in-depth. Basically what I'm trying to say is, rate my professor is great, but course evaluations mean a lot more, so putting more time into that is a more worthwhile way to be mean to me, I think. 